All right, hello and welcome ladies and gentlemen. This is Matthew McCormick reporting for NUTV Sports and I am alongside a very special guest, Demetrius Capsianis, who is a freshman here at Northeastern. Demetrius, before we start going, you started the Husky Ultras. Can you just tell us a little bit about where you're from and why you chose Northeastern as your school? Oh, yeah. I'm from Athens, Greece, Europe, European country, nice place, you should visit it. And my uncle went to Northeastern about 30 years ago, so I've heard lots of stories about the life in Northeastern, about the opportunities. So I visited Boston in 2012, summer 2012, I went to Phillips Academy. And I toured Boston, the universities, and the university that really caught my interest was Northeastern. Not only from its campus, because it has a wonderful campus in the center of Boston, but because it has lots of opportunities, academic opportunities, co-op opportunities, the best co-op in the world, and a huge alumni network, and also it has a big network of jobs, job opportunities. So if you combine all this stuff, I think Northeastern is a perfect choice for a person who has lots of dreams and stuff. Perfect, and one of your dreams started out with the Huskies Ultra, just started up the new club. Can you sort of tell us what you guys are hoping to do and what it is? Oh, yeah. Husky Ultra is like an organization, student-run organization, nothing to do with the, the university, it's not an official club. And we're a bunch of guys, friends, and people who are interested in supporting all sports. Not only hockey, not only basketball that are popular, but even volleyball, women volleyball, men volleyball, soccer. Whatever Northeastern athletes playing, we're there cheering for them, having flags, banners, and trying to do our best in order to maximize the, the positive energy the crowd gives to these athletes that they train every day, hopelessly, in order for to have the university's name and pride throughout like the um, US. Perfect, and you mentioned how you sort of got these chants, you have the flags and the body paint. Can you sort of take us through what happens when you're at a game, what you guys are doing to keep the positive vibes rolling? Yeah, we have huge flags, like flags, I, I haven't seen these in the States yet. They're like nine feet tall. And we have three of these, the, uh, having different messages and s s shapes, colors. And we have banners like Stetsonist, Stetsonist is a dorm in Northeastern. So the banner saying Stetsonist represents the people from Stetsonist. It says like people from Stetsonist support the basketball team, the hockey team or whatever game it's that day. We have also lots of chants, chants supporting teams, uh, encouraging the students who play, the athletes to do, to go harder and to make them as to give them as much positive energy as we can from the fan perspective. That's what we try. And we have days that we go make banners, we have a Facebook account, a Twitter account, and we try to, like, when it's a game, so we say Husky Zultras will be in this game, don't miss the game. So we try to encourage people to come into all games. Perfect. And you're talking about all these banners and all these things, and certainly you come from Athens, obviously a rich sports tradition there, dating all the way back to the Olympics and obviously up to modern days with the soccer culture that they have there with all the teams in Athens. What sort of elements do you draw on from your homeland when you created the Huskies Ultra? One of the things I'm most, mostly about Greece is Panathinaikos. Panathinaikos is my soccer team. So I miss going to the stadium and seeing the fans jumping up and down for 90 minutes, to see the huge flags waving, to see banners everywhere and supporting different cities of Athens. So this is what I miss from Athens. So I wanted to bring this energy, this idea to Northeastern. I came here and there wasn't a, except of like Husky Nation or the doghouse in hockey. There wasn't a group organization that gave energy. I wanted one to have for all teams, either it's hockey, which is a famous, or if women's soccer, which no one goes there, apparently. And I wanted people to, to go there, like it happened in Greece. I wanted to go to the stadium and see people jumping up and down, having flags, giving positive energy to the athletes that train every day, seven times a week, in order to have the university pride throughout the States. So I wanted this, so I took the model from Greece, like a, a union, a board of directions. We have a board of directions of Husky Ultras. And I wanted to bring this from Athens to the States. It's a big way, mm -hmm. it's like, 
but the idea travels easily. So I came here, got with a bunch of friends, talked about the idea, went to doors, knocked in doors, you want to join us? Yeah, they were like, they signed. We went to the athletic department, we talked to them about it. And we went also to RDs, like the, the people in charge of dorms, Northeastern, and we went to them and they gave us paint. They, they supported us in every way. So I took the idea, the model from Greece and brought it to the States. And I, I had the same structure that the hardcore fans in Greece have in this one. And that's, I think, why it's successful and people have engaged in Husky Ultras now. Perfect. So you've just started this club now. It's sort of getting its roots right now. What do you hope to see when, you know, five years from now you're graduating and you look back at the Husky Ultras? What do you want to say? Yeah, I think I want the Husky Ultras to be something that everyone will know in the university. Like, people would connect the athletics, the sports with Husky Ultras. Like, I went to the stadium to feel the atmosphere. I want people in five years, ten years, as long as it want, to go to the stadium, see the games, have fun and enjoy the atmosphere. And I think we could do this through Halski Ultras. Now we're, we, we aren't so many people. We're, we have a leading ab a board of directions. We have some leaders. We have a Facebook page. It has lots of likes, a Twitter page. We're trying to promote the club, the student-run club. And I hope like in, in like a few years from now, people know, everyone in Northeast knows, comes and help us. Comes to, we have banner painting. We post today's banner painting, and people came and painted banners. So I wondered, like, when it's the banner painting days, people coming and stuff, like people engaging in our energy, which the energy we give to the athletes. That's what I want. That's my aspiration, inspiration for this club and for this university as a whole. All right, Demetrius, thanks for the time. We appreciate it. Once again, ladies and gentlemen, this is Demetrius Capsianis. He's one of the founders of Husky Ultras. They're on Twitter, at Husky Ultras, and they're on Facebook. Make sure you come out and support them. You'll see them at the games. They're out there giving it their all every time. You should come and check them out. Reporting for NUTV Sports, I'm Matthew McCormick, and Northeastern, keep it classy.